Zoom. Cartoon Cat is today's winner, guys. Up on the wall. We're getting close to filling it, guys, but what you haven't seen is that there's a side around here that needs filling as well. So we've got a long way to go until someone's gonna win this Kermit key ring. Giant shout out to my two channel members, guys. They get the prime position. Let's get into today's video. Guys, we are gonna to be together in a moment for BOGO's National Anthem, written by Cookie Herbert. It's beautiful, and I need to show you how mental BOGO is here. So, sing it with me, guys. Oh, say can you see by BOGO shielded <laughs> No, guys, I'm kidding. I'm, I'm not going to sing out the entire thing, but... um. I got sent this video and it just made me it just made me laugh. You can see here guys anthem and honestly right look at the end of this right I'm just gonna skip to the end look at the amount that um cookies 45 million HP he defended for 45 million HP Right let's get into today's video guys I wanted to go over Goliath now, I'm not too fussed about um, the Queen of Hearts. I don't think she's... Sorry, not the Queen of Hearts. Uh, the Evil Queen. I'm not that interested by her. Um, but I did want to go over Goliath in a bit more detail. Because I, there are some teams that you could form with this character. And it would be unreal. So, I'm picturing a team here. Where if you had, like, um, Hades on and Goliath on... Right? These two could sit at the front. Well, a Hades doesn't actually sit right at the front. But these two could sit together and honestly tank the entire team. And just smash through. So I do need to actually get Hades maxed out, guys. And uh, let me max his skills out as well. There we go. So I do need to max Hades out because he's fantastic. Um, I didn't realise I hadn't, actually. That was quite bad of me. Um, so Hades is a character I'm working on at the moment, guys. He's slowly coming along. But I'm, as you can see, I want to get a duck out. I, I kind of want to pause now. And get everybody up to red nine and then push up and continue through so i've got a nice coliseum team but anyway it's all about this move here for goliath his first move is absolutely ridiculous guys now i don't say that often but i'm actually scared to come against goliath in the pvp area all because um all because of just his main move. Like, I, I was not expecting um, to see, well, anything along these lines, guys, because it is a little bit mental that he's going to be fully shielded, nothing can damage him, then he retaliates the damage in a roar, and it's going to hit everybody close by. That is going to be a fantastic move. If that's the only move you use Goliath for, guys, fine. I honestly think that's going to be one of the main and most important reasons to use Goliath on your team. Like I said, especially, imagine if you had, um, let's just spy with someone quickly so I can bring the team selection up. Hmm. So, picture this. You've got Goliath on. I'm going to use, um, uh, let's use... Merlin. So pretend Merlin is. Oh no, let's do because he's gonna sit up front. So power line. Pretend power line is um Goliath. Now, now this fa fantastic. Team. So Goliath and Hay is gonna be taking the damage and dealing it back, right? And then if you were to have on Goofy to speed up, then you had Winnie the Pooh on to heal. You've got four tanks, guys. Then you had. Imagine that team. Imagine that for a team. Goofy speeding up, Winnie the Pooh rinsing the damage and healing when you get his badge, um, Gerald speeding up, armor, healing, Hades taking in the di damage, Goliath taking in the damage. You could potentially form a team here, guys, that's never actually going to die. It, it could be absolutely madness. So just consider that. Just think about that, guys. Fantastic idea there. And then obviously we have got, so I do need to go into his other moves as well, obviously. Now, we do have some of his other moves here as well, guys. And they look just as good. So, I am I am quite excited about this character. Um, so, 
The flap is gonna psh, psh, just knock people back. Goliath's swipe's gonna dig in and do loads of damage. Um, allies gain armor when fully guard is used. So that's gonna hit onto Hades and that's gonna increase um, so, again, back to the team that I created. That's going to make Gerald's armor even more tanky from his normal armor skill. So, that team together could be fantastic. While channeling fully guarded glove absorbs all projectiles. So, that's going to keep everyone alive as well. So, I kind of just wanted to dig into him quickly, guys. Because there's not too much to get into. But I just needed to state to you guys how important that move is going to be. And I am going to focus on Goliath when I get him. Now, let's just do a little bit of gameplay. So, I, I will definitely, definitely be working on Goliath. And I definitely... I'm looking forward to jumping into Goliath, guys. So he should be, he is gonna be a good character. He is gonna be a very good character. Now, I, I, I really do need to continue in the story mode. So let's do um let's get my sign a bit first here. And I can continue in the story mode a little bit. I think we, we yeah, our guild smashed him through this. I just spent another 39 million gold. Um guild influence has done well. Ooh, guild coins. Uh, let me earn, let me collect everything in here again. Help with that. Um, check in. So get the influence down. Put my merchants out for everyone to use. Then the surge. And it's just ticking through them, really. Just to help everyone out as much as I can, guys. Because uh, we are absolutely crushing in this guild. I mean, we're ninth, guys. We are ninth, you know? So if if there are anyone else I can use, um, fine, I'm going to go for it. So because obviously we, we want to hold that ninth position, guys. We don't want to be chucked out of the ninth position. Okay, let's see. I don't really care about that. I don't really care about that. Oh, what are they? Oh, don't really care about that. God, awful. Oh, I will buy that, actually. Okay, cool. So, let's see if I can spend a bit more gold. So, I've, I've got all of these characters up, because me and Ethan did this yesterday, and you all quite enjoyed that video. Um, so, let's see if I've got any of my main characters who aren't maxed out yet. Um, oh, I can get Gerald's skill upgraded again? Or was I waiting to do that? So, was I going to upgrade his mods? I feel like I was going to upgrade his mods there. Goofy's maxed. Oh, level 178 as well. That was a perfect time to get that. So I can just creep everyone up, guys, now. That's going to be a million gold on each again. So that's going to bring everyone up to just such a nice level here. Also, I can do it to all my uh, most important characters as well. And this is spending gold, guys. This is helping the guild out again. This was quite a nice little time to get this, just before the contest ended. So, guys, I have a lot of characters I'm working on at the moment. So, it's, it's a bit of a nightmare to um, start new ones or do anything like that. But th that'll, that'll do for now. We we've got our main ones kind of pushed up again here, which is always quite nice. So let's actually jump into the Colosseum. Where am I? So I'm in sixth and it resets tomorrow. That's not good enough. Let's get some battles done here. Especially th this one should be easy. I'm surprised I haven't already pushed through this one actually, guys. This should be quite an easy one to get through. So yeah, because remember, if Beast stays alive, it doesn't matter anymore. See, look at that. That's, that's a beautiful and easy rinse through. So it's going to be quite important that I get through a few of these today. Um...
But anyway, guys, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Um, you can see I'm going to win this one. I'm just rambling on now, and I don't want to bore you guys. Love you all, and I'll see you all in the next one, guys. Bye.